And with that, he is Brent Hanks. I am Jeff Platt. This is No Gamble, No Future, and we welcome you to the Poker Go tailgate. We are here once again. We did it. We made it. Well, Jeff, we never left. <laughs> We've been here the whole time. You, you have been here a lot. Yeah. I you mean, and John How many and Tinder Sean. dates inside the trailer? <laughs> have you taken zero. anybody back there? No, a little Jeff no. town? <laughs> no. Yeah. I mean, zero dates inside the trailer here. But if you all want to come join us, whether you are a date or not, you can swing by. We have World Series of Poker watch parties. We're checking out the football games. We've got a little bit of everything going on. We got some yeah. golf. Yeah. We've got a putting green set up. Mm -hmm. We've got you crushing the golf. Back to back, right in the clown's yeah. mouth. How did you do that? I'm a great putter. How many takes, though? That what was that? one and done. That was one and done. First two putts, right in the clown's mouth. I guarantee. Nobody will come out here to the tailgate and do and do what I did. Wow. I guarantee it's a it. call out to everybody. Guarantee it. Okay, there we go. I'll put money we, on it. We also have Your a money. game where you throw the the pads. That's cornhole. Cornhole. Have you cornhole. ever been to a tailgate? <laughs> cornhole. It's cornhole. It's an American tradition unlike any other. It's cornhole. We have yeah. we have the smoker. Oh. The smoker going, cooking. What, what do you call We've it? We've got brats in there. Got brats. It's smoking. That vegan brat you made for Dingrano, he quite enjoy it. He ate three of them. Did he really? Not only did he have three, he told me that after he had pizza on the way, three brats here, piled a little uh, oh, adult course. beverage on top, and a then he went to play poker. poker. Yeah. yeah. We've seen him play poker after adult beverages. Sure have. How was that experience, by the God, way? God, what a night, huh? I mean, you were with me. We went yeah. to the Golden Knights game, the opener against the, uh, the crackheads of Seattle, and uh, they won 4-3. Stunning game. Unfortunately, we lost a bet. Kind of, sort of. Kind of, sort of. Kind of, sort gave us money line. We we're like, okay, money line is cool, yes. Yeah. But minus one and a half is cooler because the juice was a little better. Speaking of the juice, you get Negranu so juiced up. Yeah. He'll put you in a 5K. And that's exactly what he did. Yeah, we got right in hands. there, played a little 5K, 6 max, made it to day two, and then we uh, we fell short of the money so, by 12 spots. You know, producer John is always lurking around these real hallways. He's really just waiting for one of us to be eliminated from a poker tournament. He better catch us quickly, like towards the very start of yeah. registration. So yeah. he made his way to your table. Sure did. And I, th I think we just we just get right to it. Here is Brent Hanks at the World Series of Poker 5K 6 Max. There it is. All right, here we go. Yeah. Negreanu in the mix. Some, Some of the, the best, best players in the world. El Jefe, Darren Elias, Eric Seidel, nine-time race winner. Frank Casella, Squid, Sam Grafton. What an absolutely stacked field. Yo, Viral, your Yo, boy. Viral. Worst fold of all time. <laughs> there he is. He's, and, and Brent Hanks. Well, I qualify. You, you know, feel like you belong. You belonged in this field? Well, look, just look at me. I mean, look at these reactions. So, listen, I'm, I'm between 10 and 15 bigs this whole okay. time. I'm, I'm probably checking my emails. Yeah, I'm looking very at exciting. my, you know, cleaning the stuff out of my nails. Uh -huh. Oh, taking Just a peek. One nope. I was put all in, I believe, yeah. Yeah, it's I didn't have any of the goods there. Not a qualifier, yeah. as you would say. I will tell you. Uh, no, nope. didn't have anything okay. there. Yeah, very uninteresting. You look very relaxed, though. Very I am. I'm the most relaxed player on the field. I am. I'm the, no one's more relaxed than I. It's a free uh, this, roll for me. Yeah, that's true. It seems yeah. like a really fun evening. Took a little nap, a little snooze, and then I woke up finally Maybe. right here. Take a look at this. Maybe. The goods. Oh, all the chips? All of them. Okay, with what? Two sevens. Okay. Got pocket seven. Justin Liberto open button. Yeah. And he got a count, and I had about 12 bigs, and he wanted to fold, but okay. he's Let's got king fold. ten of hearts. Oh, okay. Just and he flip. flicks it in. Let's just win a flip. And, uh, well, we did not win a flip. It's going to come ten queen jack. Yeah. It's going to come another queen. Yeah. And it's going to be a river nine or something, and uh, I lost the flip, and I'm out of the tournament. Wow. Pathetic. Twelve short of the money. A lot of people might consider just folding. Come on in. You know, the whole way down. So you, you got you went busto in the five K six max. I went busto in the five K six max. Uh, this gentleman who is walking in. Yeah, is pull up the seat, Mr. Cook. What are we talking about? No limit well, holdem. We were talking we were talking about just the World Series of Poker overall. And so Brent fired the five K six max. <laughs> Slightly intoxicated. Cool. Alongside Daniel Negreanu, who was very much intoxicated. I saw, yeah, I saw a hand. It was awesome. Yeah, did Negreanu, 
Negreanu was He hammered. ran it up. He was yeah. top five in chips at the end of day one, and now he's still in the thing on day three. But since you're here, we might as well shift to the 25K Heads Up Championship. And that is your very first World Series of Poker bracelet. Yeah, that was Congratulations. Sweet. Very, you. very well deserved. Now that you've had a couple days to take it all in, what, what does that, that bracelet mean to you? Oh, that's awesome, man. I, uh, I'm i pumped to give it to my bro. He's, yeah. he's like always been my main support. And he's a big poker fan. So, yeah, I was pumped to get, like, really, I've just constantly been like, man, I got to get one of these for this <laughs> Yes. Guy. Yeah. Like, you know, I think, I don't know how many times I've final table a World Series event, but it's been a lot. Yeah. So it was cool to get one. And it's funny to get one in a tournament that two of my six rounds I was definitely an underdog in. That's like, it's kind of weird, you know? You said you were an underdog against Henry. Who was the other one? Without a doubt, I was an underdog without, everybody was an underdog and against so Henry. Henry was the number one player. Henry Pustinen, by the way, who made the semifinals 21 years old yeah, out like, of Finland. Yeah, he's button clicker online. All he yeah. does is, like, play heads up and and crush everyone and I don't you know so I would be ridiculous to say I was like a favorite against that guy and then in the final the kid I played was clearly like all he does is play heads up and I just assume you know like I was making the joke to you I played uh, three days of heads up so I might be the best in the world now but, uh, <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> those guys uh, those guys both played incredibly well and in the last round I didn't play my best so I think he had an edge on me for sure uh, but, I won the flips. You won the flips. It's all that matters. You took home the hardware. Yeah. I feel like I talked. About, I talked about this with you, Night of. I talked about with this with you the next day. Okay. It was like a, a live tournament atmosphere. People oh, were man. on the rail. It's crazy. People were cheering, and a lot of them were cheering for you. That's got to feel pretty good. Yeah, it was super dope. Those guys were awesome. Just random, like big group cheering for Ari. Just comes over and starts cheering for me. It was, yeah. It was fun to high five them all whenever it was. Was it tilting when they were really loud? I mean, I know it was like, guys, keep no, it down. It's just we're like, playing. honestly, that morning I got up 7 30. I had an 8 a.m. doctor's appointment with my baby yeah. at 8 in the morning. And then I had Henry the first round, so every hand I played against him was just mind bending and I was exhausted. <laughs> and then we, we get like two hours deep into the finals. And I'm like uh, kind of delirious and miscounting the pot, and then I just hear red, red, <laughs> black, black, hell yeah! And I was just like, hold up, these dudes are cheering for like the color of the flop right now, aren't they? So I turned around, I was like, guys, come on, just cheer for your buddy, but hit the brakes on the red, black stuff, and they instantly did. It was yeah. awesome. You yeah, know, yeah, most yeah. people would have been like, Fuck you. But they were like, we totally get it, and, uh, and they stopped, and, and uh, yeah, well, it wasn't a problem at all. Hey, bro, I was nice to you guys the whole time. The whole time. I said, cheer for your buddy all you want. Um, I'm all in. Cannot fold this. I have you dominated. You have six deuce off, huh? No, no, no. Yeah, and you said from the beginning, you're all about the sport. Cheer for your guy yeah, as much as you want. Yeah, for sure. Just Ari, the prop bets. Ari's an OG. He, yeah. he deserves a big crazy rail, you know? I got to tell you, though, if it was like me or Jeff and we turned around yeah. and told that crowd, you know, <laughs> knock it off, cheer for your buddy, <laughs> for sure they don't listen. But with you, you would just smash them into a jelly. Uh, I mean, Because, man, it, you know, that's what you're you... are tired from that retired. shit. Too old, too tired for that stuff. But I They would, don't know that. They were like, holy shit, Kuhn yeah. is going to... He's going to just gonna start beat my ass. No. <laughs> yeah. Uh, no, it was cool, man. And, and the whole experience, it was funny, like... Some, like, I was deliriously tired. It was kind of like I was, like, tripping on acid or something. Because, like, oh. like I would look up and, like, Brian Rass would be standing beside <laughs> me. And I'm just like, Brian, I haven't seen you in, like, three months. And he's just like, win yeah, this all in, bro. <laughs> yeah. I was just like, what is going on? Like, where did I, – I love Brian. I just kind of, like, conjure him out of my mind. Like, how's he here right now? And then Scott Venner Scott just Venner came out there. of nowhere. Yeah. Uh, Negreanu popped yeah. up. All the GG crew was on the round. Yeah, the funniest thing about all that was my uh, – my wife's dad came into town, and he had never come to sweat live poker ever. And the day of the day two of the 25k, the big one, the high roller, mm -hmm. we get final nine in that thing, and I just cooler this kid for a massive pot, aces to queens, and Dan's on the rail, and he's so excited, and we're high fiving. And it comes like, I have ace of diamonds, ace, he has black queens, and it comes three diamonds on the turn. And we're just like, yeah, and then the one outer in my face oh, God. on the river to bust me. And my and my wife's dad, I'd never, he was so sad for me. Yeah. I was like, it's okay, man. He like, felt much worse. Yeah, yeah, I've been through this a few times, it's okay. But he was like, I don't know how you do this shit. 
Like, that was ridiculous. Like, I'm, you know, he was really <laughs> shook about it. So it was cool for him to be there when I won the all ends And I was like, it's over. You can breathe. Like, it's, he was like, oh, I'm so glad it's over. <laughs> Um, yeah. but before we let you go, are you on break from short? Yeah, I got a timer set though. I think I'm good. Okay, okay, good. Then, then tell us why GG for you. Uh, the most important thing is innovation with those yeah. guys. You know, they. Uh, I feel like online poker has been stale, and they want to make the right improvements. Their uh, user interface is insane. It's hilarious and fun, and I mean. The main reason I signed is just so I could have my face going like not sure if. <laughs> yeah, yeah. The not sure if sucks out on me. Not sure if or running hot like my head on yeah, fire. Yeah. It's like basically the only reason I really. <laughs> no, it's uh, those guys are awesome. So I'm stoked about it. Yeah, we're we're stoked too. I mean, GG, we're seeing their logo all across all across our shows. They're all across our tailgate right now, which means. Well, I think you're obligated to have you got to come here now because yep. it's a GG thing. Yeah, I'm an employee. It was in Let's your contract. Let's go. Yeah. yeah, you have to make eight appearances a week here. Okay. Uh, you got anything else for Jason? No, just no. stop by as often as you can. Yeah, We're going to go live at the tailgate cool. five, uh, Friday at 6 p.m. Pacific, 9 p.m. Eastern. Uh, whatever stars, poker players, we can get out here. We're going to watch the 5K6 Max Final Table. Bit of a watch party out here. Hopefully we got Jason Kuhn, or hopefully he's deep in the 10K short deck, which is running right now. And yes. Eric Seidel has agreed to do a 38-minute sit-down interview with us That's right. Tomorrow. And we have Seidel so, yeah. for, uh, for three days for three at the tailgate. Days. I'm going to gonna make him any it. meal he likes. I'm the smoker. Okay. He Bro, loves this, hot dogs. Uh, this Aoki lady, that's, uh, yeah. Yeah. she's buddies with my friend Nick Ramponi. And before I knew her... Her and I had massive stacks day three of the World Series of Poker main event. And she didn't say a word. She was sitting there playing quiet, tight. And we both had like 150 big blinds. And we played a four bat pot where I had a huge hand, made a big fold on the river. And she just whipped a bluff in my face. <laughs> uh, just crushed me. So I'd love to see her win the ladies' event. She's a monster. She's a beast, man. Yeah. She goes deep in a lot. The main event a couple times, and now a chance to win that's, the uh, yeah. ladies' that's event. That's who I'm cheering for. Let's go. Thanks for stopping by, man. Good luck in the Good short luck. deck. Well, that was special. Yeah. That was awesome. So Jason just mentioned the 1K ladies' event. Every Poker Go stream of the World Series will just be on out here, right? Yeah, we're going to run every single one at the tailgate whenever it's on. And then depending on the uh, who's there, some of the bigger names, we'll fire up the stream and we'll, we'll do our watch party. A watch party on Poker Go's YouTube channel. Yeah. First one is going to be probably the day that this releases. It'll be Friday night, 9 p.m. Eastern, 6 p.m. Pacific time, planning to feature the final table of the 5K6 Max. Yep, yeah, that's right. Matt You'll Berkey's be going to be here. Matt I'm going to be here. Maria you after you by. bust because I know I you're don't playing. Know, but yes, I'll stop by uh, at dinner yeah. break. Yep. Uh, Maria Ho is doing commentary, but okay. I believe she is going to stop by and do a little pregame. We also okay. have a bunch of the GG guys. They're going to come out nice. here in pregame, so it's going to be a party. Okay, that's going to be awesome. So again, if you're here in Las Vegas and you're stopping by the World Series of Poker, we are out back. We are right by the All-American Dave Tent, allamericandave.com, at allamericandave on Twitter, the good stuff. Uh, speaking of the good stuff. Shall we? Yeah, cheers. Huh? Oh, yeah, a little uh, nerd focus, huh? Smarter than energy. Shout out to our friends there, mm. nerdfocus.com. You can follow them on Instagram, at nerdfocus underscore official. And if you go to their website and enter the promo code POKER, what do you get? You're going to get 20% off mm. your order if you go to their website, promo code POKER. 20% off. 20% Nerd off. Focus. Follow him on Instagram. Jeff said it once. I'm saying it again. At nerd underscore official. Nope. Get over there. At nerd focus underscore official. That's exactly right. <laughs> At nerd focus underscore official. Okay. Where can someone get a nerd focus at the World Series of Poker? Oh, that's a good question. So, pr producer John asked, where can somebody get a nerd focus? Come on, guys. We've got cases upon cases out here. Stop by the tailgate. We are literally giving them away. Free. All the nerd focus you can handle, especially if you're grinding these tournaments, you're gonna need a little think yeah. drink. Yeah, sounds good. All right, stop by, grab a couple Nerd Focus, check them out online, promo code POKER, 20% off. Let us get to the Circa Million Three. Five picks yeah. against the spread. Okay. Every single week. We are 12, 12, and one. That's 12 and a half points. That's just dead even. We're tied for like 2,333rd place, something like that. We're Last okay. Week. We we're can okay. win this thing still, right? I, yes. 
We can. You, you need to go on a little, a little heater. A few five <laughs> just, and O's. You just need a bit of a heater. Uh, last week, two, two, and one are wins. The Steelers. Yeah. The Chargers. That was nice to get carried into the end zone there in that one. Our losses. The Washington football team. Ugh. That's a stinker. Yeah. The Giants. Uh, we knew we were losing that one. And our tie. This is funny because we were back and forth on Bengals and Packers. Argued, argued, argued. Betcoin said Packers. Packers minus three. And we chop it up. We chop it up, half point. Which is interesting, by the way, Mr. Hanks, that you were arguing so vigorously for the Packers. But then I look at your card on Sunday, and you're on fire, and we'll get to that in a second. Hedging. And you had you had the Bengals. Hedging. Yeah. Hedging. Hedging. Okay. I had a big bet on the Bengals, plus three. Yep. But for the Packers in the Circa, we had them in minus three. I ha- I, I just I love the game so much, I needed both sides. I had to hedge. <laughs> Sounds good. Um, all right, so we're, we each have separately created a top five. Your top five is ready. Yep. It's good to go. Yep. I'm going to start this week. Please. I believe you started last week. My number one pick, the Patriots of New England, plus the three and a half against the Dallas Cowboys. We've already got controversy because okay. I've got the Dallas Cowboys minus three and a half. The Patriots are a terrible football team. Terrible I know. football I team. I agree with you. So it looks weird. They're only getting three and a half against a red-hot Dallas Cowboys team who has been really good over these They're, last couple weeks. Vegas is trying to give us money, and you're just you won't take it. Nope, I won't, you won't take, take it. The free I won't money. take it. Um, you're gonna have to take Betcoin, flip God a coin. Bless it. And I here can't we believe go. we're already flipping over this. I mean, this is absolutely ridiculous. All right, here we go. What is what is which again? We didn't call it. Hold on, don't yeah. look. Okay, so heads is gonna be what, John? The, the away team. Heads is home. Oh, heads is home. Oh, no, no, right. no, 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 no. I told you, yeah. Heads, I'm sorry. Heads, heads Patriots. Is the Cowboys. Or Cowboys. Cowboys are away. Tails She's Patriots. Swimmingly. Heads, Cowboys. Cowboys. Tails, Patriots. Alright, I'm gonna do it on the concrete. I want a big bang. It's heads. It's heads. Cowboys. Cowboys, baby! Let's go! Let's go. That's it. That's how we needed to start All this right. thing. So that's Cowboys, and now we get to your number one pick. Yep. Now we're gonna so go gonna right to off. my number one pick. And now, I want. I have a little theme with my picks this okay. week, and I want to see if you can pick up on it. Okay. All right, my number one pick, Chargers plus two and a half. Give me the Chargers plus two and a half. I can't, for the life of me, fathom why they continue to be underdogs yeah. every single week. They are one of the best teams in the NFL. Uh, I don't even think there's really any who debating are they this. Hold on, I'm loading my whole schedule right now. Oh, you said who are the Chargers playing? They're yeah. at Baltimore. Okay, okay. Okay, so Baltimore's on fire. Lamar Jackson just came off one of the, his career best games. Yeah. Didn't miss any passes. He's like 37 of 41. Hell of a comeback. They can't repeat that. I still don't think Lamar Jackson is an accurate quarterback. I love the Chargers. They're dogs again. Give me the Chargers. Okay, Chargers. Uh, I did just didn't have that game at all. Totally fine with taking the Chargers okay. plus the two and a half. We have two picks set. Goes back to me. My second pick. I was high on this team at the beginning of the season. Oh, I'm fuck. still high on this team, and that would be the Colts oh, of God. Indianapolis oh, God. minus ten against the Houston Texans. We gotta flip it. Unbelievable, really? No, because I'm also on the Colts oh, at minus ten. Oh, there we I'm go. I'm also on the Colts minus ten right there, just to prove it. My last pick at five. Beautiful. I am on the Colts minus ten. We do not need to flip it. Brent I love Hanks this pick. Has jumped on the Colts bandwagon. They could very easily be three and two at this point in the season. You know, I saw something that they are 28 percent still to make the playoffs. I believe it. I believe it. It's a pretty weak division. I don't think right. Titans are any good. Right. Okay. So Colts minus ten. All right. Okay, here Colts. we go. Yeah. Uh, my next pick. Yeah. I am going with another underdog. I am going with the number one fantasy quarterback in all of fantasy football, Kyler Murray, the Arizona Cardinals, on the road at Cleveland, plus three. I got the Cardinals. Okay. I don't think that Cleveland – I know Cleveland's D is awesome. The run defense is fantastic. They can't contain Kyler Murray. Okay. Give me the Cardinals like plus three. That means that four of our picks are set. So we will read out the rest of our top five. We'll see if we have any – similarities there. The rest of my top five is as follows. The Eagles plus six and a half against the Tampa Bay Buccaneers. That's that Thursday night football game. The Panthers plus one versus the Vikings. I save the best for last because you'll like this. The Bills minus six. My man. Against the Titans. My man. All right. I love that as well. Okay. So here we going to go. I actually have a theme with mine. Okay. Now I always bet the Buffalo Bills when it comes to just straight cash on me. I didn't touch them in the Circa. Because every team I bet starts with a C. To finish it off, I love the Cowboys minus three and a half, as we discussed. Yeah. I like the Chiefs minus six and a half. 
I don't know if I really like them. I kind of want them to lose in a way as well, but I've got them on my card, minus six and a half. And then, of course, the Colts, we already talked about them, minus ten. Every team starts with a C. Those are my picks. Okay, so that means since we don't have any of our same sides, Brent, I'm going to need you to grab Betcoin again. You already have it in hand. And this flip will be between the Eagles, which was my third pick, okay. plus six and a half. And who'd you have at three? I had the uh, Cowboys, which we're already which on. Are, yeah, who'd you have at? Chiefs. Four. Chiefs. Six and a half. So Eagles or Chiefs. Heads will be Eagles. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Can we do an audible? Sure. Well, yeah. Why you not have at this Buffalo point? on your card. Yeah. I love Buffalo. So you just want to go with it? Let's just go with Let's Buffalo. Let's just go with Put Buffalo. Put Buffalo on the Let's card. Go. Let's go. We don't need the coin. Let's go, Buffalo. Yeah. Okay. So to recap, Cowboys minus the three and a half. Chargers plus two and a half. Colts minus ten. Cardinals plus three. Bills minus six. This could be the five and a week. Four C's and one B. This is the guy who's on fire this season, by the way. I'm down like 856 units. <laughs> He's red hot in I'm NFL. up almost 16 units. Let's just get to the tracker I'm right now. I'm up almost 16 units. Let's get to it right now. And for me, the second season of No Gamble, No Future has been relatively ugly. I'm down uh, 20, 27 That's point, unbelievable. 27.5 units. That's unbelievable. You have been on fire. Producer John is laughing so loudly. I mean, it's <laughs> literally like, it's like three picks a week, and you found a way to be down 27. Well, I bet a lot more than I know, three you're betting the week. whole board in yeah, college we football. Yeah, we bet the board. Yeah. But it's going to turn around soon. We almost won last week. Almost won. Yeah. Oh, boy. Uh, oh, you, boy. by the way, college, you're up a little bit. Yeah. NFL, you're up 13.4 units. And you really don't bet that many games per week. No. So put, that puts you at 15.8 units ahead, plus 15.8. One of the sharpest out there. I guess. It must be nice. You're Everyone knows about Vegas Dave. They don't know yeah. about the Hanks of Heater yet. They need to know. Follow the picks. Okay. You're going to print. Fade Platt. Fade Platt. Yeah, fade me, and you can find both of our picks at NGNF Show. Again, that is at NGNF Show. Uh, we post our cards Friday, Saturday, Sunday. Fade me. Tail the Hanksy Heater because it, because it is absolutely it's never gonna go uh, out. fantastic. Side note. Yep. What would happen? I mean, I'm just thinking out loud here. I'm spitballing here. If I went to hairclub.com slash poker oh so if you went to hairclub.com slash poker yeah i'll tell you what would happen jeff poker. yeah you sign up okay free consultation what do you get with a free consultation how about a hair club visor via poker go how about a deck of cards wow. via poker go how about then you're in the runnings for a thousand dollars worth of gift certificates as well as an autograph book by phil Helmuth. Oh. deal me in just got to go to hairclub.com slash poker, and you can get all of that. So all the giveaways, hairclub.com slash poker. We have one giveaway, by the way, on this very show that has not been completed yet. Mm. That oh. it, nobody has chosen to participate yeah. and be eligible for this prize. And that prize is this, Power Mouse Deskless. You know, you're sitting around, you're playing online. Sometimes you need a mouse so you can just sit back and really relax nice. and click around State a bunch. Of the art. Has nothing to do with us getting wanting to get rid of it. So if you show up here at the Poker Go tailgate, yep, and you just ask for it, we just give it to you. We'll autograph it. Yeah, sure. We'll with autograph a crayon. it. Yep. It's going to be special. It's going to be fantastic. Uh, it's got USB. It works on PC and Mac. Sure does. That's Every single sick. one. Uh, shout out yeah. to Avi Langer, by the way, who stopped by here last Avi. night. Avi! We missed him. Both of us were not here. We're going to be kind of in and out. You'll be here for a ton of the watch parties. Never leaving. Yeah. because You don't have much WSOP commentary to do? Well, apparently, I don't have any. You know, that I was supposed to do Jason Coons. Yeah, that would have been sick. Mm. Omaha, though. Sad. Omaha, gotcha. Sad. I'll be on sidelines for some events, just FYI. Shout out Marley Caden, by the way, stepping in, joining the team as sideline reporter for a couple of events. Anything else that you would like to cover today? No, just stop by the tailgate. That's stop all I ask. Come by the tailgate. We're going to be here. We want you to join us. Producer John, anything else? He says we no. get everything? We're good. Yeah. I think we got everything. Okay, so off. make sure to follow us on Twitter, at NGNF Show. He is at Buffalo Hanks. I am at Jeff Platt. Uh, like and subscribe on YouTube. That would be fantastic. Share it with your friends. Spotify. That would be great. And we're Listen. on Spotify. Yeah. We're going to be on Apple Podcasts in like 2026, what is I guess. It Apple takes so long? It takes a long time for Apple. So if you have Apple Podcasts or Overcast or I don't know, any of these popular podcast apps, it take, takes us a while to get there. But we're going to get there. 
We promise you we'll get there. We'll make it easy. In the meantime, on whatever podcast app you're using on the side, click subscribe. It helps. Click like. It helps. Rate the show. It helps. Review the show. That helps. And we will see you next week on No Gamble, No Future.